public to get to meet the authors, to get to know the person behind the the pen that's writing, and I guess that that's what we're most proud of. Is that On the topic of writing, two New Brunswick sisters are writing real-life stories about an adventurous cat. They hope to share those stories with young people. Now, it turns out the story of the sisters themselves may be as interesting as what they're writing about. Here's Catherine Harrop. Tiki Tiger cried and cried because his paw hurt so much. They couldn't believe Tiggy Tiger lost a leg. Children at Heartland Community School heard about some of the ups and downs of Tiggy Tiger's 17 years. The Adventures of Tiggy Tiger are based on Judy Cole's real cat, Tiggy. She began writing them for her grandson. Her sister, artist Linda McCarthy, drew all the pictures. Help, help! Tiggy howled and meowed. The books all have lessons in them, telling people where you're going, staying safe, and the importance of family. Family means a great deal to Judy Cole. You see, Judy didn't know Linda was her sister. Judy knew she was adopted, but she was 25 when she finally made contact with her birth father. He wasn't taken aback at all. He just chuckled and said, Baby, I've been waiting for this call for 25 years. He then invited her over. When Linda saw Judy walking up the path to her family's home, she was certain of one thing. The moment I saw her, I said, she's got to be a Langan. <laughs> There's no denying the similarities in features and artistic leanings between the sisters. And then Judy found out her paternal grandfather had been a writer too. To be able to bring back his memory and, and, and uh, bring to life the fact that he was a writer too, I think it's important. And also, because we were, were lost from each other for so long and then to find each other again it makes it even more special to put it on the record that, that we're all family. And family takes care of family, just like Tiggy Tiger's mom and sister who get him out of scrapes, comfort him when he's scared, and show him the way home. My favorite part was the song. I like the song. The song. The song. The Tiggy Tiger books are now in six countries. Katherine Harrop, CBC News, Heartland. You may have heard reports that CBC Television plans to expand some supper hour local newscasts across Canada. They are unconfirmed tonight. Several media outlets have reported that.